Really, the barn is historic to us, and we like the, the hip roof appearance. Memories would be of uh, ha having been out there and working hard in the barn. It's as many of you and you yourself worked in the barn, putting hay up in the barn. It's hot, and I've put hay up clean to that ceiling a couple of times and straw right up. And, and those memories are, boy, those were the hard work days that we try not to do anymore. Uh, we, we've almost lost it. On, two different occasions. One was a when we first came here, we weren't here long, and a neighbor to the east of us started a fire to burn some trash. When this caught on fire, it created quite a, a heavy, big flame of, of grass fire coming across the field. It surrounded our barn. You could not see our barn in the smoke. And the fire department arrived just in time to get between the fire and the smoke and, and put wet the barn down, or we would have lost the barn. We believe the German X sign is, 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 was helpful in keeping the, the uh, dangers away from our barn and saved our barn from fire and lightning on two occasions. So we're very happy and we maintain that X sign. It's still there today. But really the barn is um, historic to us and we like the, the hip roof appearance. Otherwise, a general purpose use, you're better off with a big flat barn because you, you can drive into them better. These barn doors are smaller for our newer, bigger equipment. But, you know, all in all, we still need it and keep it for barn uh, equipment storage and hay storage. I would never like to lose it, but uh, we keep it and maintain it at a great expense because we've ended up putting our third roof on here just two years ago to keep it and to maintain it. That's what I've done all my life is farm. The barn is used for dairy cows, horses, farm animals. And I also remember the one burning over across the road, and we was in the barn milking when that was struck by lightning. And First thing my dad asked me if we was alive. My brother was there too. And after we got outside, we could see there was a light on upstairs. I remember telling dad that there was a light on upstairs. Well, it wasn't a light, the barn was on fire. Probably the big surge in building of the barns was in the early 1880s with the barn usually got painted before the house because the farmer wanted his barn to look right and so very often the barn got painted and the house didn't. There are several reasons that barns are disappearing today. One is that they're getting aged on them and they're deteriorating. Two, the cost of keeping the upkeep is high. Uh, if you have to put a new roof on a barn or do repair the siding, whatever, it is expensive. And then three, farmers today have different kinds of cows, or they don't have cows, and they have the machinery bigger, so they can't get it into the old style barns. And if they get rid of the barn, they don't have to pay taxes on that particular piece of property. So there's, there's several reasons, but the barns are disappearing rapidly. 